The Northern Cape youth have many concerns. Issues of not going to school, not being able to get bursaries when you need them the most, all those type of things, even substance abuse. The youth of today, they can't talk about their issues, they rather go and drink and use drugs. I believe that um, what is really hindering such youth people is um, like the substance abuse, unemployment, the poverty. But um, I would always also suggest that as individuals, as a young person, people should not let that hold them back. They would step forward, get to such resources. The province's youth unemployment figures are woeful. Nearly half of the young people in the province do not have access to employment opportunities. The provincial government says it has identified the gaps. Uh, the issue of structural unemployment, where there's a complete mismatch between the skills that we have and the job opportunities, which are created and particularly in the private sector. One way of addressing that is to ramp up the quality of public education and also to ensure that we, submit, we subject young people to risk killing. The Northern Cape has also received 210 million rand that it will use to train young people in various industries. It will also conduct market analysis to identify a support base for its 5 billion rand annual procurement budget. The province hopes to give more young people a piece of the pie. Ulrich Hendricks, SABC News, Kimberley, Northern Cape.